You've got to find what you love. And that is as true for work as it is for your lovers. Your work is going to fill a large part of your life. And the only way to be truly satisfied is to do what you believe is great work. And the only way to do great work is to love what you do. If you haven't found it yet, keep looking and don't settle. What's up, Miss College? How are you this morning? Hello, Miss Career. I am well. It is the best day ever. Friday. <laughs> Get it? <laughs> How can I help you today? Well, you see, I've been thinking about my favorite hobby, shopping. <laughs> no, no, stay with me here. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, about shopping? <laughs> no, okay. about life after high school and what the job market will be like in 2018. Oh, okay. Well, tell me, Miss Career, what is your passion? Shopping, like mine? <laughs> I love shopping. You don't love shopping? <laughs> What's wrong with you? Well, shopping is not my first passion. Mm -hmm. Actually, I like working with numbers, and I'm a very detailed person. Hmm. Oh, me too. Let me just tell you about my shopping experience. I go now each aisle looking at every price. I'm so detailed. I look for Uncle Clarence. Uncle every, who? Every day I look for Uncle Clarence, you know. C-L-E-A-R-A-N-C-E. -E. Get it? He's usually red with tags, markdowns. I love to see Mr. Clarence every day. Watch me shop every day. <laughs> Miss College, a little hmm. help here. Okay, I'm sorry. Well, <laughs> hmm. let's see. Involves working with numbers and being detailed. Hmm. Says here, the job prospect in business as an accountant is bright. That means there are new job opportunities very likely in the future. The salary is around $65,000 per year on average. Are you good at algebra, geometry, calculus, or statistics? Mm-hmm. Hmm. Well, how about English and working with computers and using different software? Mm-hmm. Some skills include listening to others, using mathematics to solve problems, figuring out how a system should work and how changes in the future will affect it, understanding what is written, making general rules or coming up with answers from lots of detailed information. Usually people interested in this work like activities that include data, details, regular routines, and earn at least a bachelor's degree. Yes, Ms. College, I think that is the job for me. Well, along with these skills, you'll need personal attributes to help you succeed in this job. And uh, some things like being on time, so no excessive tardies, come prepared to work, wear your IDs, communication skills, I mean, ask a lot of questions, be a team player, ask for assistance and help others, critical thinking skills, paying attention and doing your work, and creativity, which means do not quit. These skills are called soft skills. So, are you ready to learn? Yes. Are you responsible to yourself? Yes. Are you respectful to others? Yes. We, we are, are two heartbeats, heartbeats with many passions. passions. We are college and career ready. Hey, nice to meet you. You can call me coach. What do you need from me? Look to be engineers. Figure you can help us get our future in gear. Well, if you want to be an engineer, this is what... What in the world oh. is going on um, here? Oh, um, how you doing this morning? Um, Hi. Yeah, uh, we, uh I'll, I'll talk to you in your office in a second. I'll okay. be, I'll be right All there. All right. Let's yes, ma'am. Get things right in here. Yes, ma'am. Thank okay. you, Ms. Moore. Sorry. All right, well... Since Ms. Moore wouldn't allow us to make our music video, I guess we'll have a more serious conversation. For any of you guys that's interested in being an engineer, there's a couple of things you need to know. Um, for starters, if you're interested in um, going on to college, one of the most important things you can do is take as many math classes as possible, as many science classes as possible. Um, one thing they're looking for is students who are taking rigorous courses. Um, for example, uh, here at Chapman High School, we offer AP Calculus. Um, AP Physics, AP Chemistry, and AP Biology, all of those classes um, play a vital role in regards to uh, your progress in college if you're interested in taking up an engineering major. 
also some classes that are pretty important as well um, are the Project Lead the Way classes here at Chapin High School with uh, Coach Taylor and Ms. Maitland. Um, as ninth graders, um, we will start out with Intro to Engineering Design. Uh, from Intro to Engineering Design, you will go on to Project Principles of Engineering. And then from Principles of Engineering, um, you, you can take a different pathway into different um, engineering courses, uh, basically to fit the needs of uh, one of your career aspirations. Um, also, another important thing to understand about engineering, um, sometimes uh, we get an idea of, oh, I got to go to Clemson or I have to go to uh, these big colleges or Georgia Tech to be successful. Um, with engineering, the most important thing you can have is experience. Um, one of my close friends, he went to a very small school and he's making um, a good living for himself. And he's also traveling the world doing what he loves to do. So don't get caught up in the idea that, oh, I have to go to this big school in order to um, achieve those goals. One of the most important things you can do um, is just go to a college, uh, stay focused and prioritize, and do a lot of internships. That's something a lot of uh, companies are looking for, are students who are doing internships and getting that experience while they're in college. So um, <clears throat> that's just a little bit of advice. Please come down to Guidance to uh, see me for more information. and. I look forward to seeing you all. Thanks.